are you guys? My name is Tara Sagari. Today I'm going to be showing you guys how I take my self-portraits. A lot of people on Instagram have been always asking me, do I have a photographer? Who takes it? I do by myself. I also made a short video for TikTok, like about a minute, I think under a minute, and it went viral, like almost, I'd say 500,000 views, something like 100,000 likes, I think. And everyone was asking like what exactly I do, and obviously a minute was really short. So I'm going to teach you guys everything that I know yeah, everything practically that I know um, to take photos. I'm not the best, but I mean, I get the work done. And also, if you guys have any questions about makeup, hair, clothes, just comment and I'll tell you. Follow me around. Okay, so I just came inside one of the rooms in our house that has good natural lighting. And I'm going to show you guys what stuff I have, how I connect everything, what are the settings, and what you guys need and what you guys could have that would make your photo look more professional but it's not necessary okay so this is one of the rooms that i take photos a lot of the time and the only reason i do my photos here in this room rather than doing it in this room which is actually my studio is because i have natural daylight exactly this spot light comes in this is one of the only places in the house that i have this little bit of natural daylight and that's all i need because i really prefer that over using say a you know an artificial light because just natural daylight is the best kind of light you could have for photos and you do look your best in my opinion times i'm so desperate that in the closet we have a little bit of light and i've taken a bunch of photos which i'll insert here because i've laid down exactly on this floor spot and you would think that i'm in somewhere really crazy and i'll just show you guys center of the light i'm gonna click on my face focus hold crop all you need right now is a laptop it could be any laptop mine's a macbook air very old one i have to upgrade and a canon 5d mark iii it could be any canon camera um and a usb cord i bought this one from amazon i will link the place i bought it from down in the description if you guys want to buy it i have some you know cool props these are all from the dollar store they're fake like white roses red one these are party stuff you could hold and i always have a brush to take care of my hair and my frizzes a cup of water and a lip gloss if I have to, you know, fix anything, a little bit of napkin if I somehow has to like get cleaned up. So now I turned on my laptop. So usually when you buy your camera, a CD comes with it, but if it doesn't, like my MacBook Air doesn't even have a place to insert a CD. So all you do is I go on Google and I searched Canon EOS utility. So like this screen will show up when I search Canon EOS utility. I just choose whatever type of Canon that I have. Focus. There we go. So I'll just choose what kind of Canon I have. I'll click it, download instructions, and then the US utility will be on your laptop. After that, what I'll do is this little HDMI cord, I'm going to just put it into this little small place here. And then I'm going to connect the other USB to my laptop. Be right back. Okay, so I put the USB cord on my laptop. I turn my camera on like that and then I believe it's going to open up here there we go so this pops up it says EOS 5D Mark III that's my camera and then you press remote shooting right after this this comes here you could you know play with everything you know the settings if you want it to be auto timer the iOS the f-stop I'll go on live shoot Okay, so when I press live shoot, you could see exactly what the camera's picking up on. So I will start shooting right now photos and I'll show you guys what it looks like. Okay, hi again. So the camera's here. I have a little stool here. I have my laptop here where you guys saw how I see myself connected to my laptop. My laptop is on my legs. It's so zoomed in the lens that you guys won't be able to see on the photo, my laptop being here. So all I'm gonna do is I'm gonna hold one of the props that I got. This is just a birthday thing I got from the dollar store. All I'm gonna do is probably click on my face, double tap. When there is a green square, I'll show you guys right now what I mean. It means it's focused. I'll just press on the space bar button. Three, two, one. That's how easy taking photos is. And just because I could exactly see what the photo looks like, on my lap, I don't need to take 2,000 photos. I usually have my iPhone here, I'll blast some music, get in the mood, I have water, I have my hairbrush, lip gloss, bunch of props. I actually have some, um, you know, I went to the fabric store, not too expensive, I bought some fabric. Sometimes I put it like this and I use it as a backdrop 
if it's dark and I'm feeling a little creative, I'll use one of these lights that just works with a battery, but I don't like it. I usually use it for filming. And I'm gonna show you guys what it looks like from this view as well right now. Okay, so let me show you guys from this position here too. So say this is what I wanna use, right? There is, I could just go here. I click on my face. So I look in the camera. I usually click on my eyes. That's so zoomed. And then now that I know I'm focused, space bar. And that's one photo. So I keep doing that, but that didn't turn out well because I just have too many cameras. I don't even know how to show you guys how many cameras there is here. Inception. But that's basically how I take it. So I'm just going to put the camera in front of me so you guys could see a little bit of the process right now. Okay guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I tried covering anything that I could think of. If it's something I missed or something you guys want more in detail, just leave a comment. I will make sure to comment back to you guys. Also, I would really appreciate it if you guys subscribe because I basically have no subscribers. I'm so new to YouTube. If there's anything that you guys see on me that's not listed on my Instagram, I'll leave my Instagram account here probably. You could follow me. I always have my makeup details and my photos there. But if you guys want a makeup tutorial, hair tutorial, leave a comment. I'll film that for you. If you guys want to see how I edit my photos, I could do that for you. And yeah, stay safe. Take care. Mwah.